I'm joined uh, by Mr. Deepak Kesarkar, the Cabinet Minister. Uh, the decision is going to come today. What are your expectations? There are war of words between Uddhav Sena and Chinde Sena right now. One thing I'll have to make very clear that we will prefer to wait till the decision is made. Whatever is being said is all premature. So those who are always afraid that they have done something wrong and everything will go against them, they always take out excuses to justify what they have done. They have done all wrong things. They have gone before the public or the hotter with a different agenda. And if you go through the various decisions taken by Supreme Courts earlier, they have clearly mentioned that MLAs or MPs are elected by uh, by the people. What? But the fact of the matter is, they are uh, making allegations that the match is already fixed. not they meet almost every week every 15 days because of their official work in the assembly and during our assembly so many people from the opposition party go, have gone and meet uh, mr narvekar at that time also this was in progress so why they have met him because these are different authorities they will have to perform their duties also at the same time they will have to take the hearing and give the decision also and whatever has happened during this hearing is all recorded. So whatever is recorded, on the basis of that, he will have to give the decision. And decision will have to be as per the law only, because it could be challenged otherwise. So I am sure that whatever accordingly the decision come, and whatever decision comes, we will have to accept it. If we don't agree with that decision, we have every option to go to the further authorities may it be High Court or the Supreme Court. So why to make a big noise about things which really don't matter? The biggest question here is that will Ekna Chinde uh, be in the post of the favour? He might have to be uh, resigning from his post. Why, why should he resign? In our constitution itself or the rules of our assembly and the state, as per that, he will have to be get, if at all that happened, but there is no chance of that happening. In that case, he has six months to get elected again. You are making a big noise out of First thing that you have left all the principles of your party. You have joined the parties who have fought election against you. So, the public mandate is also to be because be only exist in the elections it should exist right. in the party also and that is the principle how democracy works so whenever a party constitution is uh, recognized by the election commission they see to it that it is a democratic process all right, all right. All right. thank you so much deepa k sarkar deepa k sarkar just spoke exclusively to Republic TV and he mentions that uh, the party constitution is something that would be in fact considered. Uh, there's no chance that Eknath Shinde would be resigning from his post but yes at this point of time it seems that uh, the Shinde faction, the Shinde faction seems to uh, be uh, confident and now uh, uh, it all eyes all eyes are on Rahul Narvekar's decision uh, that is going to be taking place. Uh, he will be pronouncing the verdict uh, at around 4 p.m. And uh, uh, it seems the camp of Eknath Shinde is very confident. Uh, they are very much ready if in case uh, uh, they are in fact uh, not uh, getting the judgment in their favor. Back to you.